Hi guys and welcome to the third part of this tutorial. In this part I'm going to show you how to import sprite into Unity and create a game object with it. I'll be also going over the component system for a bit. So, first of all we want to import a sprite. With other words we want to add an asset to our project. So we're going to our asset folder and right click import new asset go to the destined folder and double click the preferred sprite there we go now we have imported an asset into our project but to put it in the game we have to create a new object in this scene this year and assign the sprite to the game object now there are multiple ways uh, of doing this but the easiest way is just to drag and drop the sprite into the scene like this um, let's uh, change its position in the inspector make it give it a nice uh, place in the scene and uh, let's also change the name of the game object for now make it player um let's now save the scene we will call it level one and save the project once now it's important to understand that it's not directly the sprite itself that is being shown in the game when we start it um the the sprite you see is actually uh, the game object that possesses a sprite renderer component and these things the transform and the sprite renderer are called components of a game object now you can add a component here and there are a lot of different types of components that we'll definitely use later on in our uh, tutorial but uh, for now it's already good enough to understand that the sprite you see in the game is not the sprite itself but it's the game object that possesses a sprite renderer that has our sprite assigned to it here so if we uncheck the sprite renderer component our sprite will be gone from the scene but the game object still exists in the scene and now um, it's really uh, good enough for now to just understand that concept and um, understand the usage of game components in the in your project and um, um, it's also really important to be patient enough and take your time learning Unity because it, it will take quite a lot of time to learn it uh, and to stop being a beginner <laughs> and um, that's it guys for now thanks for watching <laughs>